Hey, I'm conflicted. And the Beatles just dropped their last song ever. Apparently, supposedly, allegedly. And I know it's kind of weird that I'm talking about this because I normally would not talk about like the Beatles and all that. But I find it interesting because they have AI in this last song, apparently, supposedly, allegedly. So with that being said, get your cranberry juice, get your Cheerios, and consider subscribing because I upload two music related videos just like this two times a week. Uh, two times if you didn't already get that. But with that being said, let's get into it. So in case you didn't know, the Beatles are a band. The Beatles, I didn't, I, I'm not gonna lie to you, my first long time listening to them, when I seen Beatles, I just thought they were like bugs, you know what I'm saying? And I realized that it, it has B-E-A-T in it, like the Beatles, and, and, and this was recently too. But ever since I was growing up, they were they used to be my favorite band. I actually have uh, the this record vinyl, which I can't show you right now because I'm recording my voice and not my face, because I don't record my face really. But just imagine a really cool record vinyl of the Beatles. And then that's what I have, okay? It's a really cool record vinyl. So the Beatles are massive. Everybody knows the Beatles. They're like Michael Jackson pretty much. They had the most number one hits of all time or something like that. It was some crazy record. And if you don't know the Beatles, bro, then get hip to the Beatles. So with that being said, though, they just dropped their last song, John Lennon. As you guys probably know, passed away a long time ago, but they still got some of his vocals, but they could not separate his vocals from this piano that he was playing. So they had to use some AI stuff uh, to separate it, as well as, I don't know what they did with George Harrison. They, he was probably playing the drums or something, but they, they have all these people and they, and they, they got the, the, the stuff separated using AI, using people. And now they dropped this song. And I, I honestly, I'm not going to lie to you, I playlisted this song. Is it crazy to me? Not that crazy. I feel like there's been better Beatles songs easily. Not even not even a question. No reaction. Light work. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I got to appreciate that they still are attempting to at least put something out. And I, I find it interesting that they used AI. Because, you know, a lot of the time, people are really stuck like a, a lot of older bands they try to stick to their uh normal copy and paste you do what you used to do you've always been doing that you see that with a lot of like boom bap rap artists where they stick to the same lane and the beatles here are doing a little bit more extra stuff i would never expect a seven year old man to be using ai to generate stuff bro but this also leads me to the question is it morally wrong to ai enhance something like this or what if, what if in the future people just start dropping Beatles songs like record labels? They bring the Beatles back using AI, bro. It's kind of messed up. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's it's a similar thing to posthumous music, but even worse because you're just using the person's voice directly. Like that's crazy. Like that is crazy. I'm not gonna lie to you. So I'm wondering if this is morally wrong. So with that being said, let me know how you guys feel about it. Let me know how you feel about the song. Is the song good? You know, I like some of the instruments in it. I like a lot of the instruments in it. I love John Lennon's voice. That man sounds like a like an angel flying through the skies. But yeah, let me know how you guys feel about all that in the comments below. Do you think AI to enhance stuff is morally wrong? Do you think AI to enhance posthumous people like posthumous music is wrong? Let me know. With that all being said, I love you all very much. I'm conflicted and I'm out. Peace.